Well, good afternoon, evening, morning, or in between. I'm Krusty the Crawfish, and this is the Aimless Adventures vlog. Welcome to it, yo. Checking out some roadside weirdness here in Titusville, Florida, with this gentleman. Not sure what his real name is. But we're at the world-famous Dixie Crossroads Seafood Restaurante and more. And I'm not sure what's up with this dude, but wait, there's another one right there. Let's try not to get plowed over by a vehicle coming in to get their crawdad on. And let's go check out this one right here. Check it out. Oh, it looks like his little antennae. Someone has damaged it. You can see that it's missing right there. And he's got still that nice chagrin look, that Cheshire grin on his face, on his facial region. Now, I don't know anything about this place. I was just simply driving down the road from Canaveral Beach and I saw these things, figured, hey, why not put them on the Aimless Adventures vlog as roadside weirdness. Now, if you know any history about this place, Post it in the comments below because there's a whole bunch of these things. Check this one out. Do, 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 do. Hello. I've got a light sticking out of my chest. But it's quite all right because I'm happy. I used to be a fond of the mud back in Louisiana. And then someone scrounged me up, threw a top hat on me, and shoved the light inside my esophageal tract. Copyright music. I will talk over it. And check this out. <laughs> I love Florida. It is so weird and awesome. So cool. Check this out. An old fountain, but wait, over there, off into the distance, right there, you see another one. But this one has an R on his hat. Does anyone know why he has an R on his hat? And he's hanging on a rope, almost like he's waiting for a boat to come by. Or, hmm, I'm not quite sure why he's hanging under that rope, but he is on a dock. However, that's not the strangest thing. Are you ready for the strangest thing? Copywritten music, and I will reveal the spitting gator. He's a spitting image of his father. Yeah, baby. So check this place out, man. We've got uh, spitting gator right over there. Getting his spin on. Let's see if we can get a little closer look at it here. Try and talk over that music. There he is. Oh, we got some fish down here. Oh, and some turtles. The spitting gator of Zanzibar. Oh, he's actually fishing over there. The dude with the R on his hat little bar over here take a look down we got the uh, koi fish shellaxon there's a turtle underneath there the restaurant and of course the wisdom of the owl what's really going on oh, almost ate my own face we're getting too close to an exit door. Now check out, we got some extra curricular on the policia. Some artwork over here. Check this out, very cool. Got some gators, got an otter, some fish, various waterfowl, these things, which I'm not quite sure what they're called, but that's a cool platypus-like beak. Even though it's not a platypus. Those are osprey, I do know that. They make huge nests. The weird bird that just sits there with its wings open all the time. Dude in a canoe getting his fish on. And here's a little information. Larger than life. Muralist Al Roa. So apparently this gentleman was from Titusville. And he must have painted this. Hence... We can't take one. There's no one to take. But I'm taking you. Go to this website. Send a little love. Don't know if the gentleman's still around. Spread the love. 
and the art and the goodness all out there into the webosphere. Throw it up there and see what sticks. Just when you thought it wouldn't get any weirder, we have run across, well, I guess I'll just put it this way, a whole gopher village. But they're not gopher, they're actually this. Crawdad family, Crawdad family Robinson, Dixie Crossroads in Titusville, Florida. These guys are just waiting to get picked up. There's a lizard. Mr. Crawdad, using some duct tape over here, must have had an injury from the war. And then Mrs. Crawdad and J.R. Crawdad, who apparently, one of the two, one of the two of these, one of the two is into the nicotine. Well, puff, puff, possibly a little COPD in the future. Right there is the evidence. Fess up, Junior. What is really going on? Is Mama the sneaking smoker? Or are you puffing a little on Grandpappy's tobacco? No, not everyone's here. But we just need, I just need you to call it. Someone's not going to get any dinner bought for him, Richard. Richard better chillax. Mama is not happy with you. All right. While they're having their little dispute over who's buying dinner and whether or not Richard's getting any of it, I'm going to let you guys go. But right before that, let's check out those disgruntled dolphins. Disgruntled dolphins. Disgruntled dolphins. Disgruntled dolphins. They look rather sinister. This one here got an eye infection. Creepy tortoise. Another giant eye. What's with the giant eye? And here on these, whatever these kind of whales are, you know what kind of whales those are? Post a comment below. Let's all learn something. That's a, a sea turtle, I believe. And those are porpoise or dolphin. Which one are those? We know whatever they are, this one's disgruntled. Or maybe he peed in a road and he has a sty in his eye. I'm not quite sure. Check us out on the social networks, Aimless Adventures, all one word. Instagram, Facebook. Don't forget, share this video if you like it. Post a comment. Share it. Do what you want to do. Say goodbye from Titusville. My little friend right here who has got a problem with his neck region, his esophageal tract. Now, if that was a lightning bug, it would make sense, but it's not. It's some weird, freaky, weird-looking crawdad from Titusville. Keep it real, because every day is an adventure. Make yours aimless. Or I'll send these guys over to your house. Mud bugs. Can't get enough of the mud bugs. Mud bugs on the side of the road, people going by looking at you like you're weird because you're staring at a mud bug.